In the 1980s, agencies including the International Telecommunications Union and the International Maritime Organization collaborated on the development of a global search and rescue plan based on a combination of satellite and terrestrial radio services. Called the Global Maritime Distress and Safety System, it changed international distress communications from being primarily a system of ship-to-ship -ship communications to a ship-to-shore communication system. It spelled the end of Morse code communications for all but a few users, primarily amateur radio operators. GMDSS relies upon the establishment of specific sea areas and redundant distress communication systems. It required the installation of upgraded suites of communications equipment on board vessels and at shore-based telecommunication centers. The GMDSS provides for the automatic identification of the caller and the location of a vessel in distress. It went into effect aboard commercial ships in 1999. For these vessels, the GMDSS system is compulsory. Recreational boats are termed voluntary vessels because they can choose whether or not to carry GMDSS compliant equipment. Rescue authorities strongly encourage them to do so. The GMDSS established mechanisms for issuing automatic distress alerts even in cases where a radio operator doesn't have time to send an SOS or a Mayday call. It requires ships to be capable of receiving broadcasts of maritime safety information in an effort to prevent marine emergencies from occurring in the first place. GMDSS mandates nine specific functions that compulsory ships must be capable of performing. Transmitting ship-to-shore distress alerts by at least two independent and separate means. Transmitting and receiving ship-to-ship -ship distress alerts receiving shore-to-ship distress communications, transmitting and receiving search and rescue coordination communications, transmitting and receiving on-scene communications, transmitting and receiving locating signals, transmitting and receiving maritime safety information, transmitting and receiving general radio communications whether ship to ship or ship to shore, transmitting and receiving bridge to bridge communications.